Kamal bhai let's look at the sound of the sarangi because it's got such a beautiful voice yeah and sarangi is considered to be the closest instrument to human voice um is it even closer than the than the violin is to the human voice uh, it's the shape of the instrument is like human body as you can see it has a stomach and the chest part and the mouth <laughs> and it doesn't have legs it would be running away, running away from me so it is supposed to be the closest instrument because it sounds like someone singing i can um, why don't you show us yeah see how it yeah. can replicate the human voice i just give a brief demonstration the concert can okay come on के ठाड़ो है गैल फने या भरन कैसे जाऊ मोरे आल it is the um, whatever you sing whatever comes out of your mouth while you're singing it can imitate it can uh, play the 90% of a vocalist sound let's yes, look at the right. instrument it's carved from a single piece of wood yeah it's carved from very skillfully designed from a single piece of wood which is called tun t u n uh -huh, yeah. and um, it has a belly portion which is covered with the goat skin uh -huh. and then there is a fingerboard here and then it has uh, small pegs uh -huh. for this strings how many main strings do you have it has around 3 main 3 3 main gut strings they uh -huh. sound like this normally the third one is also uh, used to be as gut but i have no wish it and and change it into a guitar strings i am using a guitar strings what <laughs> you replace one of the three main strings yeah, well, with a guitar uh, string get our strings much much more easier to get the best sound because that third string takes quite a lot of efforts to to get the best sound of it and it has around 35 um, sym sympathetic strings uh -huh. and they are just not for playing they are just for the resonance while you put your finger on a particular note they resonates at the same time uh -huh. how do they work with the main strings why don't you show us please? yeah it works like if you put your finger on the uh, note so the sound stays for a while it doesn't yeah. dead immediately yeah. so you hear the ringing sound after uh, i have stopped playing so it helps, provides uh, a resonance yeah, after you play the main absolutely, strings absolutely absolutely yeah. provides a resonance it provides a big round sound yeah. you know Now you have a fingerboard but I see you have no frets on the sarangi. Yeah, there are no frets. It's it's, it's actually one of the most uh, difficult the, instruments. The strings to are just floating over there. Yeah, so you uh, and especially you played with the cuticles, the top parts of the fingernails. Really? Yeah. That sounds have, really painful. It is initially when you start learning, when you start practicing, it can be really painful but slowly and gradually you you start getting into it and that becomes easy.